everybody, Marion the Barbarian here with another TRC Shave and Chat. We got a good one for you today. I'm excited to use it. It's going to be my second use of this razor. But before we get to the razor, why don't I show you what we're going to use. We're going to use the Art of Shaving Bergamot Neroli. Nice citrus white floral scent. Um, creams, real easy to work with. In my opinion, Art of Shaving is like one of those. Now, I haven't used it myself. It's on the list. We're going to get it. But, like, you know, you should pick up Tobbs, use it every once in a while. You know, give it a try. Just so you can say you've used it. It's one of the ones everybody's used, mass produced type thing. Same thing with the Art of Shaving. Um, Mitchell's Wool Fat, Perrazzo, you know, Palm Olive, things like that, Chella. So, we whipped it up in the Captain's Choice Aquamarine Copper Bowl. This is their heavy duty. I do like the coloring on the aquamarine and uh, the razor company brush that is a beauty of a brush in my opinion all right guys so we're gonna lather it up it's already lathered up but we're gonna apply it to the face add some water if I need to but we got some good peaks these creams aren't known for their uh, residual slickness but they are effective and they whip up rather nicely and quickly so we got a willies blade we're gonna load it up first use of the willies um, I believe my first shave was with a uh, willies are double wrapped by the way no glue I had used a Gillette Wilkinson sword saloon pack first use of this razor um, I can't say it's like a Merker 34C or 34G because I haven't used one. I do have one on loan that's going to make it into my rotation soon. I started with the Merker 1904. I like the Art Deco style handle with that. And that's what drew me to this retro is because it's very similar. And the way the handle is very attractive in my opinion. Finishing isn't perfect, but for $29.99... I think it's an outstanding looking razor. It is hollow. We're going to give it first go. Oh yeah. As I thought, nice mild. Efficient razor. I haven't used another for tip. To compare with any of those but this is nice um, you don't really feel the combs I know a lot of people don't like using open comb because they're like oh you can feel the teeth and I won't lie I've I've had a few razors I felt the teeth on and that's not an enjoyable shave for me I don't feel the teeth on these though And like I said, finishing isn't perfect. I don't think anybody would expect it to be. Ooh, did open up a weeper. I had some weepers on some previous shaves, so I wouldn't say it's from this razor. I've been trying out some cheap uh, plastic Chinese razor I got for 99 cents shape before this on my channel. If you haven't seen me, um, check me out on YouTube, Marion the Barbarian. I'm sure there will be a link for my channel in the description below. I do like these. I believe I knotted this with the uh, G5C synthetic knot. Picked up from the razor company as well. Nice knot. Nice handle. I do like the handle. Very affordable. My kind of thing. This is a nice razor. I'm, I'm glad I picked it up. Oh, that's what I remember about this razor. So when you do rinse it, the water tends to sit in the open comb. So when you rinse the razor, you kind of want to give it a light flick. 
to get the water off the open comb because it will sit there until it touches your skin and then water starts running down your face. Which isn't a problem, but then if there's hairs and stuff, then it runs down your chest. And if you've already showered, you don't want stray hairs, you know, getting down your shirt. So do remember, after each rinse, make sure you have a... Uh, you get all the water out of the comb. It's important for me. And if you wait till the end, I will show you how to use my stipped. Like I said, not a lot of residual guys. Still does the job, but it, I shouldn't be going over that already shaved area with this cream. Doesn't have that extra slickness and protection for all that. So I'm going to wet the face just a little down here where we know we nicked. There we go. Get it wet. Dry the hands just a little. I'll dip my styptic in my mug. And just take it and clean it up. That was a nice shave. That is what you call a DFS, um, a damn fine shave. We're gonna follow it up with the matching aftershave balm. Not normally a balm guy, but I have the matching balm, so we're gonna use it. Two small squirts. Face. I'll even get it into the goatee hair. But yeah, we had a very nice shave with this. I'm glad I have it in my collection. I won't get rid of it. I like the aesthetics of it. The shave is good. It will get it will hit the rotation, but you know, if you're just looking for a change, something looks a little different. I like it, and I'm not even a long handle guy, but I, I do enjoy this razor. Second use now. Nothing wrong with it. Enjoyable shave. You don't feel the teeth. In my opinion, that's the most important about this. You do not feel the teeth on the, uh, oh, it didn't get completely dry. You don't feel the teeth on the open comb. And I would say that is the most important thing to take away from this because that's what I want to know when I'm looking at an open comb. Mm, am I going to feel those teeth? But you don't feel the ends of it, and they did a good job of rounding the bar. It's very nice. Um, well designed, TRC. Very nice shaving brush. I like them, they're affordable. Sometimes they have knots, sometimes you can pick them up and put your own knot in there. Um, it's just whatever you want, it's the way to go, they got it. I do recommend picking up one of these, uh, either this microfiber or this one. Uh, this is the more affordable one. But the whole point of microfiber is you can wipe your um, items down and not leave micro scratches. Resin's going to get scratches built up over time um, from clanking in your bowl if you're a bowl latherer like me. I've gotten good at not clanking though. Um, but if you also wipe down with microfiber, you're not getting those scratches from terry cloth. Same thing with your high polish razors when you do buy a high end one. Not necessarily this one, but a high end one. Um, they work well for that. Alright guys, I think that's it. We did cover everything. Um, if you enjoyed the video, you know, consider giving it a thumbs up. And we will catch you next shave.